Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to dual boot Windows 7 and Ubuntu 12.04 without using Windows Installer, Wubi in this case. So let's begin. Go ahead and download the Ubuntu ISO. The link is in the description box below. You can download the 32-bit version or the 64-bit. I would recommend the 32-bit. Once you have downloaded the ISO, you need to burn it onto a disk. I have few links in the description box that will help you do that. Once you have downloaded and burned the ISO onto a disk, right click Computer. Then click on Manage. Here click on Disk Management. Now I only have one drive, so I need to partition this drive by shrinking it. So right click on the drive and select shrink volume. Okay now here it tells you the uh, size available for shrink 30 gigs and then enter the uh, shrink space in megs. So I'm going to use 20 gigs so it's 20,000 megs and then click on shrink. perfect here it is now make sure you can identify the partition before uh, installing Ubuntu now place the disk in the drive and restart the computer it should ask you to boot from CD or DVD if it doesn't I have a link in the description box so you can change the boot sequence in the BIOS here it is when you see this press enter perfect now it's booting from the Ubuntu disk that you have created now here click on install now I'm sorry install Ubuntu I'm gonna leave everything default but you can place a check mark to download updates or install third-party software then click on continue now click on something else option here and click on continue. Now here identify the uh, partition, select it and then click on add to create a swap area. Now new partition size I'm gonna create a 500 megs. You can select up to a gig no more than a gig I think is enough use as select swap area from the drop down and then click on OK perfect we have created the swap um, partition now go ahead and again select the uh, free space and click on add now here is where we are going to install Ubuntu so now here click on primary partition I'm gonna use the full space so I'm gonna leave it like that and the uh, location partition beginning leave use as as extension for journaling and then the mount point is the root and then click on OK perfect select it again and then click on install now now I'm going to fast forward this process the installation process but I'm going to leave it here so you can see it this is some basic information I'm not gonna transfer anything from my Windows uh, user account so I'm just gonna click on continue and Ubuntu is installing 
Now, once this process finished, when it restart, it would ask me if I want to boot from Windows 7 or Ubuntu. Perfect. Now here I can select Windows 7 or Ubuntu. Now keep in mind this is not a dual boot using a Windows installer or anything like that. This is a full dual boot. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, please feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.